What's up, what's up, what's up? Ooh, let's see. Something cool to show you guys.
Oh yeah, you ready for this? This? Yes, look at this. Oh, we've got the OG swag boy. Oh shit. Yep, yep, yep. We got that OG swag. Ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh, and it's so soft. Ooh, daddy likes. <clears throat> daddy like. Oh, man. What I need to do is move this pan. This. Time for our next date, Josh. You know it, buddy. I'm all over it. Like white on rice, homie. White on rice. Checking out the new swag. See the swag monster? Checking out this fucking hoodies. Look at this shit. Look at this. Oh, man. So nice. It's so nice. Um, yeah. Just think, we if we go big time, I mean, I know at two viewers a night isn't going to quite cut it, but boy, I can see my mods wearing these. I can see me sending my mods some of these. These are dope. Get some snapbacks. Ooh, shit. Now we're talking. But ooh, it's so soft. It's like on the inside. Inside. Inside is like... Ooh, look at, let's see. Oh, man. Oh, it's, it's so fuzzy. So fuzzy. Don't mind me, it's like, it looks like I'm groping myself. Ooh, but I'm not. I'm feeling, I'm feeling it on the inside. It's, it's just so nice. Ooh. It's, ah. Three sixty six. Uh, Forty four more days. Uh, that's going. I mean, I got this. I mean, like delivered delivered today. So I mean, I guess that's not so bad, right? I mean, that's one way to start your night. Get some OG swag going on. Woo! I love me some OG swag, dude. Love it. Love me some O. <laughs> Let me change this out in my pole. Pole of the Solus. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
No, it is. It is really nice. It's, it's got that nice, thick, like, internal, like, super fluff on the inside. Oh, man, it is. It is really nice. Uh, it, uh, it's warm. It's warm, too. Like, that's the thing. Like, oh, it's, it feels good. It feels good. I mean, if you're gonna if you're gonna go all in, I mean, fucking just go all in. I mean, this is about as good as it gets. I mean, life's short, right? Might as well get some swag, you know. Eventually, I'll put this shit up. I'll put something like this up in the store, the stream store, and you can fucking spend your coins on it. You gotta pay for shipping and shit. People are always looking for some nice swag. You know, this is... <clears throat> Get yourself some... Sell some nice shirts. Self. <clears throat> <coughs> I would hook my mods up with some of this type of shit. They ain't never around. So they ain't gonna get... You gonna get... I might, I might have to, I might have to send you some though, Josh, for your dedication, and send you some of some some swag like this. Get you a fucking GG, really gaming shirt. Wear, be like, look what, look what the G man hooked me up with, bitches, for being loyal, fucking being in his stream every night. Motherfucker sent me a hoodie. Represent, maybe a snapback, something like that. Just never know. You never know. No, post that shit in Discord and be like, "Look, fools, you're missing out. We're going places, bitches, and you ain't invited." I see how it is. I got, you know, you gotta. It's like eating meat. Sometimes you gotta cut away the fat. You gotta cut away the fat, Josh. Blah, blah, blah. Got all the Christmas shits up. We're here in search of lost artifacts. Did you get any Christmas stuff up? Deep below huh? the surface. The scanner has picked up the target. Go to the dig site. This thing fucking hauls ass when I move. Holy shit, like the sliding's un uncontrollable. Holy shit, this thing's nasty! It's almost as nasty as my swag. What's not yet? Speaking of which, I still gotta post those two other streams from the other day. To YouTube. Just so I still stay on my, my posted times.
Oh. Oh, I forgot to rename the stream. I'll have to do it tomorrow. I'm gonna rename it to the Josh and Gorilla Date Night. Look what you found. Extraction is available. Ooh. It slices, it dices. Oh my gosh, it's the pole of the soulless. My warframe is strong. All the way over here. Sit down. Ooh. See that one coming. Oop. As I'm fucking so in the void. Derp. The excavator has lost power. Find another cell. Woo! Get melted. I used to have na I used to have natural talent on, but then I'm like, you know what? I don't need that. I need more range and I need more fucking power. So that's what I did. That's what I did. I went more range, more power. Said fuck it. I'm gonna break all the norms. But like he can, he can, he can move. He, his animations are fast enough. You should be able to cast that shit without fucking dying. Give him just enough health and sustainability so that he can get through it. Because once he's in it. Once he's once he's in the once he's in the rift, it doesn't matter. Like, is as long as your two is on, you ain't gonna get hit by shit. So all you gotta do is just last long enough to get in into the rift. Oh fuck! One of these. All right. Oh, I see you. I see you, you little zombie freak. Uh, so what'd you do today, Josh? You do anything fun and exciting? Has been located. Proceed to the dig site. Uh. What a mess. Let's clean it up. Oh man, Black Ops with your brother. Oh man, I thought I was your brother, Josh. That hurts, and I would never play such a crappy game. Brothers don't let other brothers play Black Ops 4. That's like that's like letting your friend drive drunk. You just don't do it. You just don't do it. Oh, there's one. Ooh, look out! Look out! Little maggots.
<clears throat> so did you get your butt whipped? Did you, did you get your ass kicked in Black Ops? I used to be the fucking king at fucking COD. Way back in the day. Fucking not anymore, man. How many fucking cheaters out there, man? Not about that life. <clears throat> What's going on at the bottom? That's cool. Wait a minute. Yo, why is this? Yo, this is an Oroken Tower. What the? F Whoa, wait a minute. Hold your tits. What the? F huh? Wait a minute. This is an outer terminus. I'll take that battery though, thank you. The reach! Reach on this thing is filthy. Look at this thing! This thing's fucking gross! Just a f it's just a fucking killing machine. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts. Sit down. No. No. We need to purge this place as we did in the old days. No. 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 Yeah, and blackout a loot. Oh, a lot. Oh yeah, no blackout. All C all COD games are just fucking. They're just hardcore fucking fucking cheated. It's worse on PC. Like you got fucking aim bots. You got fucking. You got all kinds of crazy shit on PC. That's why I won't. I won't. I won't. I won't do competitive fucking unless it's like a league thing. Where it's an organized, structured thing, but even then, you still have guys that fucking cheat. There's guys that have cheated on national fucking tournaments, like in national competitions on TV, have fucking cheated. Like holy shit! Like that's that's fucking atrocious. That's like the cardinal sin, man. I get it, you gotta do whatever you can to win, but, like, there's ways to, like, fucking, like, there's ways to fucking cheese, like, in the game. Like, you can fucking camp. You can fucking, like, you can do, you, you can, you can camp in spots or use the map to your advantage. Like, if there's a glitch in the map where, like, you're in a spot where you can shoot out, but they can't shoot in just because of the way that the hitbox works, that's not cheating. That's... You're using something that's in the game, but people that use fucking like aim bots and fucking like no recoil with automatic weapons and shit like that, or like it's just fucking like no like super fast reload times or fucking weapon swaps or shit like that, like 
That's that's the that's that's annoying. That's that's part of the reason why I will never. Tenno, a new alert has begun. It will be marked on navigation. Oh, I got my combat pay. Sweet, I got my fields on. Messages in your cool. inbox, operator. Nice. Uh, they are not as encrypted as they. Yeah, should. that's fine. Let's see. Uh. Bye. I can tell you understand what an honor this will be to have your tiny neck snapped by the Kayla the Fucking defection. Ugh. This this one here is easy. That one not so much because I don't have enough energy. So it literally drops my energy down to a point where I can't cast I can't cast Cataclysm. Because it only gives me 50 energy. And I think it's because I only have. New alert marked on navigation, Tenno. I can probably take out. I could probably take out Augur Reach and put in Flow. <sighs> Wait, what's Arcane Strike? Oh, attack speed. I don't need that. Don't need attack speed. I really only really need theory and guard and uh, energize. That's all I need. Um, but let me take off. I'll drop me to 250. But stretch. Here, but we'll come back and put that on after. But prime flow here, that should give me enough energy to cast. <clears throat> That's gonna give me plenty of range. Duration will be slightly less. I think the bubble will only last like 30 seconds. Huh. It lasts almost a minute. So, yeah. I guess that's a thing. That doesn't look right. That looks like the exact same loadout. Hold on a minute. That's the exact same loadout. Look at this. 70. Can't be. That can't be right. Let me change. Let me change. Back. That looked exactly the same. That can't be right because my fucking duration was like 200 and something. It was still the same amount of time. That ain't right. <clears throat> the 
pole of solace needs a fucking needs a lens. Let's see. Uh we'll put a greater narrow mind lens on. Everything else is fine. Let's see. Huh. That's weird. My duration the same? Oh, it's the same. My efficiency is the same. What? That doesn't make any sense. And how? But my duration's fucking like three times. Like that's two fifty, and that's one seventy nine. And the time is exactly the same. That doesn't make any sense. That makes no sense whatsoever. Huh. That's... Interesting. And why does Augur Message have two tiers on it? What the fuck? I only have one Augur attached right now. Oh, no. You know where the other auger is? I bet you the other auger is on my piranha. Yep. Yep, there it is. Oh! Alright, alright. Alright. That makes sense. Okay. Alright, so... That's weird. Why why are these times in this energy source? Ooh, that is really weird. Hmm. The duration is exactly the same. My stasis is about 30 seconds, which it's normally at 30 seconds. And my duration for the cataclysm is about one minute. I have to cast it twice in order to do mobile defense. That is really fucking weird. Hmm. This one has much bigger range. Much bigger range. Weird, weird, weird. Hey, what's up, kitty cat? Bye, kitty cat. All right, I'm going to try to do this solo, except for defection. So I'm going to do the first two solo. Tenno, you really want this? Fine, let's I'm going to do these first two solo, and then I'm going to fucking... I'll team up with a team. <coughs> What are we what are we feeling we're gonna get tonight? What are we gonna get tonight, Josh? Is it gonna be another fucking a fucking reactor blueprint? A catalyst blueprint? Ooh, I can't wait. The fucking worst drops you can get. Your mission is to break into enemy vaults and steal any intelligence files you find. The Grenier used to be builders, but now all they make is war. Your powers are... Your powers don't work here. Will be a complete failure. 
Rip. I had it! I just got ripped off, dude! That was the clutchest save ever! Holy fuck! What?! Wow, dude! I totally got fucking boned on that one! Wow! Dude! That's some fucking bullshit! I clutched that thing! Ugh! Oh my god. Wow, that is... That's... That's dookie. I, fu I fucking solved that puzzle too. That's some fucking bullshit. Oh, are you serious? Yeah, you ain't doing this one. There's too many fucking consoles for this one to open the door. I'll take my L on this one. I'll take my L on that one. That one you have to fucking, you have to hit like three consoles. There's no fucking way. I was getting that in fucking 30 seconds. And I, there, the one that patrols down below does not scan, is not supposed to scan the area where the, uh, where the console is. Where you fucking put in the key. He's not supposed to be able to see that. I don't know. No, 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 no. I don't know if that's a glitch. Because he's not supposed to scan that space. He's supposed to scan the walk in front. Um, like around those blocks. So he goes around those blocks. But his range for his lasers are not supposed to be long enough to reach that console. So I don't know how he saw me. I might have to go into operator mode and just grab that one. I, I really don't want to do that, but... Your mission is to break into enemy data Cause that shit's- that's- that's cheese. That's cheese. Holy crap, there is a massive delay in my buttons.
don't even know it's gone. What's that guy gotta shoot the fucking wall? Got your gun facing the wrong way, bruh! Fucking Grenier. Bunch of fucking derps. You gotta just chill the fuck out. It's on the other side of the room. It's on the other side of the room. Why am I getting frozen here? Yo, did you see that? Dude, he was completely unaffected by the fucking rift. You, did you see that? Like he I've got I've got stasis. Everybody else is frozen except for him. Yo, that was weird as fuck. Why did the Why did the Lynx not get affected by Whoa, that is weird. What the fuck? That's the first time I've ever seen that. Oh, you want some of this OG swag? Yeah. Yeah, that's called be around more often, you douche, so that I can fucking do things like that, huh? Huh? No, there's no boss. There's no boss in this in this mission. It's just fucking spies. And that's not even he's not even uh the boss boss is, uh, what's his face? Um, what the fuck is that guy's name? The one that's on Venus, uh. Oh, what the fuck? You are nearing the console. Check the alarms now, and they will start destroying the data. Ooh, look out. Um. What's, which one is this? Oh, this is the elevator one. Okay. I have to somehow... You've triggered the oh, that's good. Lose this data and the mission will be a complete failure. Holy fuck, dude. Dude, I was behind a fucking wall and that thing saw me. Come on, man. Rip. 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 
Ah, oh, what a fucking... That's fucking garbage. I was behind a wall and the thing fucking saw me. I'm just gonna have to use operator mode around those things. That's some fucking bullshit. Really don't want to do this. I don't know why I'm having so many problems with the fucking spy mission. <clears throat> I think it's because it's, uh... I think it's because I can't fucking... In a timely manner, I can't... I'm getting a massive delay in my fucking response... Oh, uh, my fucking cables. Hang on. <clears throat> my X button... Fucking tap things is... <clears throat> there's a massive delay. I need you to get inside enemy data vaults and retrieve crucial intelligence data. My warframe is strong. Console is nearby. If you trigger the alarms now, the enemy will start destroying data. You've triggered the alarms. Use this data, and the mission will be a complete failure. See? He's completely fucking immune to it. Wow. That's so fucking weird. Why is he the only one immune? Like, even his fucking drones weren't immune to it. We already have Clem. <sighs> me, Grenier, me not smart. And I swear, those fucking little eye things, they can fucking see everything. Even in operator mode, you see me in operator mode? It still fucking saw me, man. What the fuck is that? That's the whole point of being in operator mode. They can't see you. Fuck, man. I fucking hate those things. Fucking stupid ass eye bots and shit. Thank <laughs> you. 
You're nearing the console. Trigger the alarms now. We'll start destroying the data. Oh, this one. Alright, night's up. Enjoy. one it is so let's see if we can fucking do the elevator one without fucking getting caught this time What the fuck? Ah uh, ha 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 ha. The target console is nearby. Trigger the alarms now. The enemy will start destroying the window. Oh, this is the stairwell one. This one's easy. Fuck you talk. Marines inbound. Uh, what the fuck, dude? Like there was nothing there was nothing around me. There was nothing around me to trip that fucking alarm. I don't... That makes absolutely no fucking sense. There was literally nothing there. Holy shit, dude. Are you fucking serious? Wow, that is fucking garbage. That is bad, bad, bad mechanics. Sorry, when you're an operator and you're in void mode, you can't be seen. Period. End of story. That's the whole fucking point. <clears throat> I don't understand why all of a sudden, magically out of nowhere, these fucking droids... Can fucking see you. They can't see you. <sighs> wow, that's so fucking aggravating. That's fucking. That's infuriating. Like that. That's really bad. Because that should. That just should not be happening. I should not be getting caught like that. I get it if I'm not in operator mode. You're nearing the console. Trigger the alarms now, and they will start destroying the data. Oh. 
Look, that guy just fucking went right by me and didn't fucking trip the alarm. What the fuck? I have, I have, I have no, I have no idea, man. Get out! Thank you. Data integrity verified. Retrieval was successful. <clears throat> see that's see that's part of the problem too. Like that consistency is terrible. I literally had a guy, I had one of those robots go right by me, didn't even fucking see me. And then now, all of a sudden, that one fucking robot can magically see me. Like, what? That makes no sense. There, that doesn't make any fucking sense. And there was no robot, there was no robot there near me! And it's like, oh yeah, I see you! You do? Cause that's fucking news to me. There's no robot on that upper deck. There's no robot on that upper deck. So how is it possible that you could have seen me? I don't I don't understand the logic or the reason behind these fucking robots. These fucking seers, whatever the fuck it, whatever the fuck they're called. What I need is an enemy that's gonna be in the in the sphere so I can fucking stasis lock the ones that are inside. The target console is nearby. If you train the alarms now, the enemy will start destroying data. Are you fucking serious? I'm not gonna get down there and get that open in that amount of time. See, that's the shit I'm talking about. That's, this is the fucking, this is the shit I'm talking about. I was behind the fucking pole. I was behind the fucking pole, man. And I was in fucking void mode. I was in the void. Like, and it could fucking see me. That's not right. That's not right. I'm sorry. They have got to fix that. That is a fucking problem. There is no way to get to the back of that fucking room without those things seeing you in any mode whatsoever. They have to fix that. That is a fucking problem. The point of operator mode is to be able to go through a fucking level unseen. That's the whole point. That's the whole fucking point of operator mode. When you're in the void, you're not in this plane. Holy... No, they'll still see me. That's the problem. They will still see me as fucking Ivara. That's the problem. Like, you're supposed to be able to pass through beams and lasers as fucking... As Limbo without any problems. That's... That is Limbo's thing. That's his thing. 
Because you're in the rift, which is not of this fucking plane, not of this existence. But no, apparently that's not how it works anymore. It only does this in sorties. It, 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 I shouldn't say that. It only does it in these missions with these fucking robots. The robots that they use in these things are the only time that this doesn't work. Every other time it works perfectly fine. So where is the level where is the level of consistency in the fucking play for those specific type of alerts? If uh, if I can walk through a laser wall, why can't I walk through fucking lasers from an enemy's fucking eyesight? If the laser wall can't see me, the robot lasers can't see me. Makes fucking perfectly good sense to me. Look! It's not even looking at me! Holy fuck! Right there! Right there! That's a perfect fucking example! It didn't fucking even look at me! Wow! That is fucking atrocious! That is atrocious! That just proves that the fucking thing is broken! You see that? It fucking didn't even fucking... It didn't even look at me! And it still went off! Huh? If it can see the operator, it's going to be able to see Loki and it's going to be able to see Ivera. That's just the bottom line. If it can see the the operator when it's invisible, it's going to be able to see it's going to be able to see your mission is to break any data vault it's going to be able to see the uh, uh, Ivera without any problem for the lotus i mean that that that's a joke that's an embarrassment Wow, that's that's fucking dick, dude. Did you see what they did there? They 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 put they put they put a fucking they put a they put a one of those fucking robots in between the fucking thing so you can't see it. That's, that's fucking bullshit, dude. They literally put a fucking robot right underneath the, underneath the arcing stairwell that connects the, 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 the center column to the, the sidewall there. So you can't, you can't see that. That's fucking bullshit.
Holy fuck, dude. Why is this taking so long to load? Oh, is it because their fucking servers are broken? Fucking surprise me. Like sometime today? Oh my god. Pretty sure we broke the game. Pretty sure we broke the game. I should fucking go back and clip that fucking issue with those stupid ass drones. Like, yo, you need to fix this. Because I can go into any other fucking mission and run the same fucking spy missions with those things there and just stand in front of them as the operator and they won't even see me. But for whatever reason, in the sortie, they can fucking see you. Which doesn't make any sense. Why is it consistently different? And they're the same fucking robot. It's the same fucking robot. Secure Robot 5000 or whatever the fuck they want to call it. Yo, I gotta get a, I gotta get a lot of these fucking fucking bots and shit out of my chat. It's hard for me to fucking see who's. I'm just gonna get this shit done. I just wanna get it done. I don't give a fuck if I play with scrubs or not. Tenno, you really want this? Fine, let's do I just wanna get over.
target console is nearby. If you trigger the alarms now, the enemy will start destroying data. You've triggered the alarms. Fuck. Lose this data and the mission will be a complete failure. Ooh, I was getting ready to pull the plug on that one, man. Yeah, I should have stuck with the fu I should have stuck with Limbo. <sighs> Going through that fucking laser wall, and I'm so afraid that it's gonna fucking fail. That. Uh Why does my chat why is my chat stuck on my window? You're nearing the console. Trigger the now and they will start destroying the data. That last guy was just standing at the door. I don't know why the fuck he didn't go in. I don't understand why that guy didn't go in. That was rude.
I don't even, I don't even remember picking up any fucking focus. I don't even remember picking up any focus. Need to do some Kuva farming at some point. Dude, that dude's that dude's all butthurt. Nova never again. But Nova's the one that fucking solved the last one, and he got that puzzle done in time for that guy to fucking get down there. I don't know what that guy's bitch. Fucking wah, wah, wah. <sighs> I love when dudes get pissed off like that. Guys clipping through ships. Whoa! Now he's stuck. All right, there This is a mobile defense mission. You must deliver payloads and defend a number of locations while I break into the network. Be prepared for heavy resistance. I can't do this without you. I know. Ballistics and archaic weapons, crude and dangerous, just like the Grenier. Keep moving. None of the scanners have detected you. For the lowest. Here is your time. Get me in and get ready to defend. This will only get more difficult. Get to the and prepare for resistance. Terminal spotted. Upload me and prepare to defend. I'm in. This will take a moment. Continue to defend.
reached. Drop me in and defend our position. Continue to defend. <coughs> Mission complete. Excellent work, Tenno. Weird thing is, in that entire mission, you didn't use an article once, so I don't even know why that's even, why that's even there. You don't even use an arc wing. Why is that even there? What's the last one? Oh, the last one's fucking... Ugh. Defection.
Oh, looking for Alan. How do we need to do? That's the question. The question is, how many do we need to do? If we have to save five groups, that's not bad. We can afford to lose a few. We just need to get one five from each group out. So I'll just cast. I'll just hit them with, uh... have barricaded themselves in safe areas throughout this galleon. Escort the crew to the waiting escape ship. The crew here are covert vectors. Grenier who rejected the violence they were committing before. Rather than join the Meridian, different path, seeking a dream of existence where they would not be forced to commit our atrocities. Sweet! That's what I've always wanted. Yay! Hello, Spy Grayshad! Yay! I know, right? Okay! I'm real. I'm really. I'm really pulling for. I'm really pulling for that. Uh, for that eye tan now. God. Can I fucking cast my two? Holy fuck, dude. Oh, of course not.
It had to be... I hate fuck I hate these fucking missions. I I f I can't fucking stand this mission type. This is probably by far one of the worst defections like and the fact that there's a fucking frame tied to this one is just atrocious. Can I get over that fucking thing, please?
That should be the last of it. Oh my god, I got fucking one shot. Wow. Are you serious? We need another fucking squad? What? No fucking way, dude. That was fucking two. Oh my god. Come on, man. Got you. Yeah, Zach, come on. Come on, dude. Too loud, too many noises. Hurry up, B. More cicat These don't even look like Grenier, dude. Like little fucking chubby Oompa Loompas. Oh, come on, Tubbs. There's one fucking guy back here that's fun. Come on, dude. Holy shit. Fucking Iatan! Woo! Woo! Put that in the bank. Oh my god.
fucking can't, man. I fucking can't. Can't do it. I can't do it, man. <sighs> Ooh. Can't fucking do it, dude. Can't do it. It's fucking unbelievable, man. That is fucking unbelievable, dude. I want to see how many of these things I have now. I want to see how many of these. Twenty six just in my inventory, not including in my ship. <sighs> this one apparently doesn't have any fucking... I've got eight of those. I have enough to fucking do like six fucking packs on the store. Or five packs. Let's see, which, which, which one do I have the least amount of? Fingers or grab weight? Oh no, it's this one here. So I can do one full five pack of Iatan sculptures. Like one of each. <clears throat> Cause I don't have a lot of these ones. I don't have a lot of the piv. Uh, but I've got everything else. So what I should do is just do like uh, a crap load of five packs of Iatan the uh the Anasses. Do one five pack of one of each and then just miscellaneous other ones <clears throat> on the store. I have enough to do. If I had more of the pivs, I would have, uh, I would be able to do a few more packs. I could do at least three if I had two more because I've got three of the finger graboid ones <clears throat> and I've got three of the ribbies. So I got to update the store too because I have additional, I've got more frames I got, I can add. I think I've got, uh, I think I have another Necros. So I have, I have two full Banshee sets. Don't have an Ember. I'm missing just a blueprint, I think. I have, uh, I have two Frost Primes. I have two Hydroid Primes. I have... I almost have another Limbo. I have almost a Limbo set to add. I have a... Uh, don't have a full Loki. I do have a full Mag Prime set. I can almost do two. I need one more blueprint. Uh, I have three Mirage sets. Or two Mirage sets. Yeah, two Mirage sets. I have two full Necros Prime sets. I have one Nova Prime set. No next Prime. Got. I need one more Oberon piece. Make enough to add an Oberon Prime. I have two full Saren sets. Two full Trinity sets. One full Valkyrie set. 
one full Voban set. And one Zephyr Prime set add to the store. So I've got quite a bit of stuff. That's just that's just frames. That doesn't include guns. Uh and swords. I've got four Brayton Primes. I've got one burst in prime. I've got two Brayton Vandals. Uh I need just a lower to have a Cernos Prime available. Uh I've got an Ignis Wraith. I've got th uh, two Gorgon Wraiths. Uh, I've got six Paris Primes. Got one full Sybaris Prime, but I can do up to seven. The only thing I'm missing is just a barrel. Uh, I've got a full Tiburon. And I've got a full Tigris. For secondaries, I've got one Ekbalto. I've got uh, how many links do I have? Five Ek Bronco Prime sets. Uh, I have no links. I've got the blueprints. I've got one, uh, almost one full Ek Stiletto. I've got two Ballistica Primes, three Bronco Primes, one Ladle Vandal, I need a receiver here, get the Euphonia Prime up. I got six Lex Primes, I need just a few more pieces for this one. Uh, I've got a full Bow Prime, a full Dockwer Prime. Uh, I've got six Fang Primes, three Fragger Primes, two Galantine Primes, one Nakana Prime, five Ortho Primes, two uh, Silver and Aegis sets and I'm missing one gauntlet for a Venker Prime. I've got the Ordona Prime, Superior Vandal. Got two Helios Primes. Fucking bunch of Mantis parts, but no. Some I got a bunch of stuff I need to add to the store. Get a bunch of stuff I need to add to the store. <laughs> Doesn't really matter though, because nobody's in stream, so they're not earning enough points to fucking spend uh, on it. Boo hoo hoo. But I do have to go into my inventory and get rid of all the shit I don't need so I can get a little bit more money. Inventory. Another miscellaneous garbage. The system continues to fall into chaos. Check navigation for active invasions. I got have a shit ton of these fucking revenant parts.
I got fucking four broken war blueprints. <laughs> Yo. Yo, that's funny. I can build fucking ash. I can build another ash. I already have two ash primes. I don't need I don't need two fucking ash basics. That'll give me fucking four ashes, two basics. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna hold on to Oh fuck. Man, they should ask you if you want to back out of that, dude. Like, are you sure you want to cancel that? Cancel out? Why does it immediately fucking... Like, if you have shit that you want to sell off, why is it canceling out? I'll add... I'll add... The... I don't know why I have an Amperex blueprint. Grab that. Don't need the they don't need the Uh, you're number four on the leaderboard there with your goings. Too bad you don't. Too bad you're not on uh, PlayStation. Spend those hard-earned goings. And get yourself something nice. I don't know why I have that. Got me I already have one of those crafted in it. Fucking trash. Wow, 350 something thousand? I'll fucking take that. Oh, yeah. Give me my money, boo. I think you have to get the ash. Don't you have to get the ash blueprint from, uh... I thought you had to get the ash blueprint from one of the fucking drops. Oh, I guess you don't. I thought they dropped from one of those fucking weirdo maniacs. It's not. I guess you can just buy the blueprint from the marketplace. Now I have all the parts. The chassis systems. Only missing one part to make another ash prime. The fucking systems.
Alright. Uh, let me see what my focus situation is. 354. Alright, so what are we at for in here? Okay, okay. <clears throat> We're at two something. Max. Not max. We'll max that out. And we'll start working on this one. <clears throat> so that's going to leave Void Strike, Flame Blast, and then Blazing Dash. Okay. So. Because this is max, right? Max. Alright, so we're only going to have just this three, these three here, and then this one will be done. And then anything that's Matterai, I will flip to uh, Zeneric or Naramon. Because then all I have left is just this, and I've got a lot here I need to fucking do. I, gotta, I have to do all of this. I don't even have this one unlocked yet. Fuck. And then I'll have all the schools on. I'll have all the schools done, and then I just have to focus on getting that pool up. Pool, pool, pool. <clears throat> Once it gets to 171, that's the cap. Can't go any higher than that. I'll be able to unlock all. Okay. So that's the plan. I also need to get some fucking platinum stats. So I have a funny feeling tomorrow I'm gonna be doing a shit ton of trading. While I'm sitting at work. Tenno. There's a time-limited mission alert available. Check navigation. Uh, uh, uh. Are there any void? Nothing in the void. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So we'll just do Sanctuary Onslaught. Oh boy. Josh, so we're officially at two, we're averaging two viewers per hour now. Officially. Right, we're averaging, that's over the last 28 days. Congratulations. I'm drinking the clouds. See that? <clears throat> it's so tasty.
Oh boy, this guy's bad. I can see this one going fucking really fucking short. Holy crap, this dude's getting fucking dropped like it's nothing. Follow one of those fucking spheres. There's the death orb. Oh, there's one over here somewhere. On the other side. Just give me that. Weird. Now, did I did I touch that one already? I don't think so. There we go. Hunter, your reliance on that ability is skewing my data. I have disabled it for now. That's weird. That one death orb doesn't work. Huh. The other one worked perfectly fine. That one worked. I don't know why the other one didn't. This guy's getting dropped in fucking wave two. It's just a, oh. Hopefully that. Holy shit, dude. That guy's fucking... Go What's your frame made out of? Fucking glass, dude? You should not be getting dropped like that. And fucking... You should not be playing Elite Sanctuary Onslaught if you're getting dropped like that. There's a lower mode for lower players. It's called fucking Sanctuary Onslaught. That's where you should be playing. If you're getting dropped in wave one, two or three times, there's no way in hell you're gonna be able to fucking do this. Like you shouldn't be you shouldn't be playing you shouldn't be playing. I know that there's like a learning curve to playing in here. But seriously dude, that's that's atrocious.
Oh, we'll see how far we can go. I don't think I'll be able to go that far. Is that a maniac? It is a maniac. What the fuck's he doing here? Pulling at ninety-seven percent. That's not too bad. Let's see what we do here.
Ooh, my dude looks like an efficiency is dropping real fast. How the fuck do I not have a single energy orb drop yet? What's the likelihood of that? Well, it would be helpful if like enemies actually fucking dropped me energy. A, they were spawning too far apart, and B, I wasn't getting any energy. I still got almost 100,000 out of that solo. That's not great, but not much you can do. You can only take what you can get. What I'd like to have completed wave 6. Whatever the fuck it was, 7. I only got one more. That happens. So that's a hundred thousand right there. Oh, so if I get a quality group of four, I should be able to get like one eighty per run, give or take. That's more than enough for me to fucking. Because I don't mind stopping. At, like if I get close to, if I get to like three hundred thousand or three thirty, whatever, close enough where it's negligible for me to get that last thirty. I'm not gonna get thirty thousand. I'm not gonna get it.
Oh, waiting for Fortuna is like fucking.
<coughs> Whoa, this is a different one. Okay, that's weird. I was expecting a different map, but that's okay. I was expecting a completely different map.
I wonder how far just the two of us will be able to go. The fact that he's pretty squishy, he's whole, he's doing all right. We're still at 100% efficiency, just the two of us. That's pretty fucking good. That's impressive.
27%. We're in trouble. Damn it. Hunter, you exceed expectations. You are far more exciting and complex than any specimen in my sanctuary. Oh, let's see. One. Yes. I love my I love my Lado Vandal. Shit. I love my Lado Vandal. Who else is in chat? Has Tam X. I see you B. Welcome. Welcome. You can say hi. We don't bite here. At least not hard. Alright, how much more focus how much more focus do I what daily cap at now? Ooh, just over a hundred. That's one run. That's easy peasy lemon squeezy. So we're at 407. Let's finish up. Maybe we can get to half a mil there. That should get me at least one fully ranked and then maybe two more spots. So we might be able to finish Manorai like in the next two days. That'd be fucking fantastic. I love to see that finally fucking done. Then I can just focus on Zenerik and then Naramon and never have to look at it ever again. Well, that is unless they add the two other schools, which are not, which were not added to the game. Did you know about that? Did you know about the other two schools in the, uh, the Zarman 10-0? Probably not. Most people don't. What the hell is this for? Oh, this is the Linux Foundation. Yeah. Let's see. So there are two. There are two other uh, tenor schools. Um, that were never that were never added to the game. So uh, What's up, Isaiah? Yeah, the other two schools are Penyaga and Konexi. Those are the two other schools that were never added to the game. I'm not sure what they're for. I have a funny feeling the only reason why they didn't add those two schools is I think 
I think they are... I think they're like an evil side. Uh, something that would torment or turn people onto the evil side. Sort of like the Deathstalker type. Even though the Deathstalker wasn't a Tenno. Uh, but there were two other schools that were used. And I think those ones were like chaotic evil type schools. Yo, Isaiah, you like the you like the swag? Like this? Like this? Ooh. I know you like this, bro. <clears throat> the o the OG the OG swag. We got the got the hoodie. Next will be the snapbacks. Oh. Dope. Dope fly fresh. Uh oh I forgot. Hold on a minute. Let me since you're in you're in here more than anybody else, so uh well other than the exception of Josh. But we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna give you that VIP we're gonna give you that VIP love. Uh <clears throat> Thanks, man. I like looking fly. I like looking fresh, too. It's all about looking. Gotta look fresh, my dude. Ooh. That's actually not the ability I was trying to fucking do. I was trying to do I was trying to do three. Oh, that's okay. That's what I was trying to do. So I can get the super popping pimples. You reach your 200 on Warframe? Very nice. What'd you pick? Closing in at 400, baby. 400. Thirty-five more days, baby. Thirty-five more days. I'll have it like January first. I'll have my 400 day login. I'll get my prime vigor. Actually, technically, it's 30, 30, yeah, 34 more days. So that's where I am. And down. I kind of missed my launching point there, but that's okay. Sometimes I get two daily logins though, but I'm not complaining. You got two? Well, it depends on when you log in. 
if you log in before the reset, you're gonna get the day before his login, and then you'll get the day the other login when you log when the when the when the thing turns over. I'll be back on, I'll be back on very regular, huh? Because you're the only one that's in here, Josh, and you don't talk to me. So normally when he's in here, you guys fight back and forth and you have somebody to talk to. But because nobody else from fucking Discord shows up, not even drop by, not even say hi. It's cool though. We're going to need to do another house cleaning. And I haven't seen Steph in a minute either. I don't know where the fuck she's at. Channel Mom is fucking MIA, baby. We might need to find a new mom soon. I know she went to some fucking weekend thingamajig with her girlfriends. She went to some sort of beer fucking brewery thing this weekend. A bunch of her girlfriends. I guess she had a good time. I guess she needs to get out. No, you shall not. No, I shall not. What? Hey, man, I'm not gonna keep people around if they're not gonna fucking if they're not in the channel if they're not support if they're not if they're not supporting the channel. I don't need I don't need I don't need freeloaders dude. I got enough freeloaders in my life. I don't need any more. Next thing you know, the fucking they're gonna want some of this fucking OG swag. And then when we go and then when we go big, Josh, people are gonna be like, oh shit, I was there from the start, but like hell like hell you were. I'll call a spade a spade, I don't give a fuck. You ain't supporting it, you don't get to rep it. That's what I'm talking about. How do I literally have no energy? Again with the no energy drops. Where the fuck are all the energy orbs? You've got to be kidding me, dude. Not a single fucking energy drop out of like 400 kills? What the fuck's going on here? What is this? I don't even have enough to keep my fucking...
Oh, now you give me energy. Thanks. When it's time to fucking leave. I swear I'm loose. You're loose. Can we get another Mexican? New mom. Hey! That's what it takes, dude. I I mean shit, I haven't seen her. It's been what? A week? It's been a week since I've been fucking I've been on on Twitch. I haven't seen her, haven't heard from her. She hasn't even been in fucking Discord, dude. And I know, she, I know she's got a Twitch Prime account, because she shops at Amazon Prime. So I know she's got, she has a Twitch Prime account. Because I told her when she signed up, when she signed up, uh, when she joined the clan, I told her, I'm like, go to Twitch, sign up, sync your Twitch Prime with your Warframe account, and get Trinity Prime and a bunch of fucking free guns and shit right from the start. So I know she has a Twitch Prime account. So she has a Twitch account. But there's no excuse for her not to just stop by and say hi once in a while. I mean, or to even check in on the kids. Like, she's got to check in on the kids, right? What's up, kick ass? I need another fucking ladle barrel and I can make I can add another ladle vandal barrel to my fucking store. I haven't even seen I mean Sky came by like once just to see what's up and then that was it. Like she came by, she's like, I don't feel good, I'm out, and then that was the end of it. We all got stuff to deal with, homie. But you don't alienate your friends, right? You don't alienate your family. I guess it is what it is, my friend. I don't fucking... Yeah, Nezza's pretty good. I'll show I'll show you my Nezza build. I'll use I'll use her to do some farming. Use him, I should say.
again with the no fucking energy drops. There's nobody fucking here. Finally get one. Okay, because I have no idea how to build. All right, later, Isaiah. Uh, I used this Zaw because this Zaw is specifically built for Elite Sanctuary Onslaught. That's why.
There has to be an enemy leash somewhere nearby. Oh, well, that's why. Maxed out on my I maxed prime vigor already roughly. Oh you pick prime vigor as your mod at two hundred? I wish I had that option when I was at fucking two hundred. I got prime fury. Like what the fuck? And then when they made the change, I'm like, man, that's cheap. Cause dudes that come in right from the start are gonna be able to pick fucking prime vigor. Like, right from jump, which is fucking aggravating as hell. Because that, that mod is OP as fuck. That mod is OP as fuck. I had to wait, I had to wait until 400 to get it. It was, I can't even, I can't even do anything about it. So that's, that's a fucking, that's a fucking kick in the balls, dude. Getting there, baby. Getting there. This one's done. I don't know. Ooh. So close. So close. New alert has begun. It will be marked on navigation. So close. Alright, we'll hold on to that. So, how many more do we have left? We've got three there, three there, and three there. This one here is going to be the biggest one. This is probably going to be close to a million. Why do you use what you use your nether for? Pretty much anything. You can use them for pretty much anything, man. Uh, let me get my nezha out. Uh, I don't think I have a dedicated slot for him. So, Neja has a couple of builds. Not the one I want. Dude, this is basic bitch Nezha. And then this. Is my. Dragon. Let's see if we can get some, let's see if we can get some different colors on. Let's see. Let's
<laughs> uh, that might work. A little pink bitch. Because I think if I prime him, he doesn't come out right. So let's, uh... So, because the way that the dragon is on the back, I think that's tertiary. So, like, if I wanted to go prime, it's base white. And I think the dragon becomes... It's tersh. Then if I go... If I go gold trim. See, the gold... It doesn't gold very well. That fucking... So if I, I'd have to go, like, black or white. The white... And then the Tersh. I think this is the one that's the dragon. I don't know. It must be a different. It must be a secondary color. That's a really. It's accents? It's gotta be accents. I don't like that orange. It looks good on some parts. It looks very bronzy. And then energy color is always that light blue. So is this color. One of these up. It's normally this color. See, I don't like that. It changed the fucking dragon's face. See that? The dragon changed face color. Wow, the dragon face is the energy? Wow, that's fucking lame. Wow, that's fucking lame. Ugh. Used white, different shades of gray and black. It changes to one of the fucking... I was thinking maybe go with one of the three colors for Umbra. Look, but why does this helmet look like it's gray? Is that because this is black? Yeah. I don't like that. We go white there and then switch the secondary to black. Alright. That's manageable. <clears throat> Alright, now I just gotta fucking change all of the attachments. Hold on a second. Switch default colors. Change. Not the regalia. Definitely don't like the top being that white though. So that's gotta change. That's not it's the main Ah fuck it.
Whoa! Uh... What the fuck? Um, hello? What the fuck is this? Oh, we're sending that to Twitter. Um... Oh, let's see. Where's my pound? Where's my pound sign? I'm going to put no head Nisha. There we go. You mean Baruch? Yo, what the fuck, dude? Okay. I guess I'm just gonna have to fucking play him without a head. I guess this game broke. What the fuck? Dude, no, there's not they're not the same. They're fucking completely different. Did his head just grow back? Yay! Okay. <clears throat> so uh kick ass. So there's three builds you can use for Nesha. Okay. This is what's known, uh, these are the build. that's what I call them. You can call them whatever the fuck you want. But this is what's known as paved and fire. Okay, so it gives you a shit ton of range, gives you a lot of duration and efficiency without, you sacrifice a lot of strength. Yeah, right, potato, potato. Baruch, Baruch, not Banuk. Fucking dumbass. So, paved and fire is basically designed around his two ability not two yeah firewalker so you're basically just running around and fucking setting everything on fire and destroying everything basically see the energy it's six to cast and then uh its duration lasts for 39 36 37 seconds give or take so it also gives you a slight speed increase uh, and then you're basically just running around catching everything on fire. That's basically all it is. It's just running around, setting shit on fire, and just destroying shit. That's pretty much all you're doing with, with that. Uh, you can cast Warding Halo, but it's not super effective, uh, with that build. Um, and then there's... What's known as what I call raining spears. 
I should just I should move this one uh, so raining spears is exactly what it is so he has an ability called divine spears uh, which basically just grabs everything and then slams them into the ground this basically gives you almost 70 meters like in all the like every direction to grab on enemies and just slam them into the ground <clears throat> and when you you impale them you're doing 1200 damage and then when you cast it again it slams them into the ground doing another 1200 damage so that's 2400 damage just by casting uncasting so you go four 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 you just pick everyone up slamming them into the ground you're just killing everything Warding Halo and Blazing Chakram go pretty much hand in hand. If you have people that are stuck on spears, they rework Neja. So if you use Blazing Chakram and you throw the Chakram while people are are hooked, uh, it will it will uh, it will give you damage. They they'll drop health orbs and shit like that, and then you can use things like uh, um like health conversion and things like that to get energy back. <laughs> uh... And you can also see that there's a chance to drop energy orbs, blah, 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 if you hit him with the chakra. So that's this build. But notice the duration isn't very long. It's basically designed to cast just to spam it. You're going to spam, 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 spam. That's why That's why uh, you're just going to be turning it on, turning it off, turning it on, turning it off, turning it on, turning it off. That's all you're going to do. It. And then there's this build. This is what's known as the Baby Rhino. <clears throat> so you're going to use an augment called uh, Safeguard, which basically... Rap, tap, tap. What's up? Uh, Psyches... Psyches V? So you're going to be using an augment uh, called Safeguard, which allows you to do Warning Halo over your... Uh, allies, which basically gives them a buff. Um, you have massive amounts of strength. Your range is limited. Your efficiency is slightly up, but your duration is very low because <clears throat> you're not really going to be using it for anything except for warding Halo. That's it. You're just going to cast it. You're going to run around the map, and you're just going to kill a bunch of shit. That's it. That's all you're doing. You're basically impervious to any type of damage with Warning Halo cast. And the amount of strength that you get. So if you see my damage absorption goes up to 4,979. Damage per second is uh, 38.1. But just call it 30, 382. And then my absorption multiplier is almost 8. So you're basically never going to die so let me uh let me grab i'll just leave the pole arm on i don't even need to i don't even need any guns i just need uh i just need uh i don't even need the synapse just give me uh give me the baza I don't know the Baza. All right, let's uh. The cat's gonna die. Cause she's gonna have literally no health. So we're gonna take that off. Sorry, cat. Nothing personal. You just don't need what I need. Oh. So let's go take him out. I'll show you what he. Is is Mr. Kickass even still here? Is, Mr. Kickass, are you still here? I'm gonna still be here. I see you. So let's uh So remember what I told you, you're basically just casting three. That's it. 
Cast three and just run around. That's all you gotta do. Let me get my magic. Stuff, the good stuff. Scoozy. Oh yeah, he's got crazy, like, parkour sliding speed. Like, if you run in one direction and then cut back, watch. Hold on. Alright, so basically all you're going to do is you're just going to cast your three. Right, and then you're just going to run around. You can cast your one if you want, and then... Wee! Dead. I think Baruch's gonna be awesome. I will 
Might as well. Learn from the skirmish. Let's go on the offensive. La 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 no, fucking cat fuck out of here reinforcements available do you choose to leave now or continue fighting continue to defend you will be rewarded for your bravery and screws Oh, I'm at my damage cap. Nice. La 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 la.
Wow, that Nox got fucking melted. I can show you what mine looks like. The one I have on right now. Fucking two hits puts him down. Yo, yo, that's what's up. This last guy. That's Nezure for you. I should be in the top. Oh, number one! Number one on the kill sheet, baby! Number one on the kill sheet. Is Nezure good? Nezure's good. That's a thing. So let me, I'll show you my Zaw. Uh, this is uh, the Varget 2 Ruhog Link, the Shuck Tong Grip, and the Sep Fan Strike. Those are the three parts that you'll craft. Here on the. Uh, let me see. I am opposite. So I would point to my right hand. So up there. Up there somewhere. <clears throat> No, left hand. Left hand up there. Sorry. Wrong hand. It's up there. Over there. It's up. up there. Tells you what you need to know. Right uh, over there. Somewhere. In the general vicinity. Always the side of the screen. Right over there. Tells you what you need to know. So you need those three parts. It is opposite. For me, the screen's opposite, so I have to think, oh, it's this hand. Left's on the right, even though my right is on my left of the TV. 
are on the stream. <laughs> so I got it's backwards. It's double backwards. So these are the three parts you need. Ian Fusion. I see you. Okay, say hi. So that would be that would be the first strike. That's the first uh That's the first one I would build. And then Um I mean if you want to build like a katana or something, build one of those. Uh I I mean you have to you gotta level them all up anyway. So you gotta go to Hawk. So I gotta go to Planet Earth anyway. So Ooh. Mobile defense. Some night tame. Don't mind if I do. Granny's house. Yeah, have you guys ever heard that song? It's the worst song ever. Granny's house. I don't want to go there.
to defend. Must have gone up. Oh. <clears throat> Another job well executed. Woo! Top of the leaderboard on the kill sheet. Uh, can you trade Zaw parts? No. You can, how apparently you can trade Zaws though. I guess that's a thing. So if I put, uh, if I go into chat, if you do, so what you do is you do. So what you do is you go into chat and then you say, uh, Zaw. And then it lets you pick which completed Zaw you have. So, like, if I want to trade uh, my pull of the Solus, I can pick it. And people, you can sell it. And people can open it and take a look at it and see what it's about. Like, oh, let's see. It's this, this, and this. And they'll be like, oh, shit. These are pretty decent stats. I can make something out of this. So you can trade. You can trade them. If you build it, you can trade it with somebody that, uh, that wants it. You can craft, uh, you can craft Zaws and trade them. This, the same thing will happen with uh the same thing will happen with um with uh with what do you call it the uh the guns the uh the kit guns so uh on um, i i am not trading my my saws unfortunately most of my saws have a specific task for specific frames so that's why I will not be training. Like I have Plague Star weapons. Uh, I have specific blades that are set for specific tasks. Like I craft. Like I don't craft them just to craft them and have like just to get the MR. I craft them for a specific task. So like there's different parts of the Zaw create different combinations of things like status chance. Speed, damage, crit chance, crit damage, reach. Uh, these are all things that you can, that your parts, uh, your parts uh, will do for you. So I'll show you where to get the parts and I'll show you what each part will give you in return. Like they'll tell you what you're going to be crafting. You can pre-craft it to look at it before you build it to know what it's going to look like when it's done. So don't don't just buy willy-nilly parts. Don't just buy willy-nilly parts to craft a Zaw. If you're going to craft you're gonna have to craft the
the strikes anyway for MR rank. So what you want to do is to make sure that the strikes that you buy. So there's two of them that you won't be able to get. So you won't be able to get the Plague Kiwar or the Plague Krippith. Those are only available during the Plague Star event. So unless you have unless you have the blueprints for these, you can you will not be able to build these two. These do count towards MR ranking. So next time the Plague Star event comes, buy these. This one here, especially. This one is they they both do viral damage natively. But the Plague Krippith on a pole arm is insanely good. Like, it is OP as fuck. It's really good. There is no rush. So, the Bala... The Bala is like a dagger strike. The Bala is a dagger strike, which I use for Anarus. Like, if you if I show you my Anarus build, it's called what's known as uh, Pharaoh's Blade. I use that with him because I have a... I have a an arcane on it that allows me to gain energy back <clears throat> so on a finisher so every time i get a finisher i get a a massive chunk of health back on every kill pretty much it's a 50 percent chance that i'm going to get health back and i can normally chain together like three or four finishers together with that weapon because it's so fast and i also use covert lethality which basically makes it so that i'm going i'm guaranteed to get a kill so when somebody's confused and you do a finisher, it gives you basically insta kill. Uh, so that's so this one's lightweight increases speed at the cost of damage. So if you notice, if you look at the the uh, if you look at the description there, it tells you what each strike will give you. So the next one over is this one gives this is basically for machetes and extended pole arms. This one's kind of garbage. Uh, if you're going to use this one. You want to use this on a pole arm, not on a handle. As a machete, it's just not very good. On a pole arm, it's a different story. It's it's got a much longer reach. Uh, it's heavier. Uh, it's kind of like an in between. Uh, it's kind of an in between blade. It's not super great, but it does the trick. Um, these are designed for uh, pole arms and rapiers. Uh, so it's lightweight at the cost of damage, so you're gonna give up damage to use this. Uh, this is a lightweight one, uh, but it's, it's used for heavy blades and scythes, so it can do quite a bit of damage. Um, this is another heavy, does damage at the cost of speed. Uh, this is another heavy, this one does damage at the cost of speed. Um, this is for a sword or a staff uh, style weapon, which is what I have here. So this is the one I use. So this one's, it's the most balanced out of all of them. So like if I, so if I put this on, very good, very good. let me, uh, let me build it out so you can see what the stats look like. So each of these pole arms or handles also have stats. So like this one's used, this is a two handed grip. It's the cheapest one out of the group. Uh, so you're going to lose, you're going to gain speed with it, but you're going to lose damage. This is a, uh, this is for a sword. Uh, this is for a sword, sword, sword daggers. Uh, so, uh, and there's also two pull, there's two handles here you won't be able to get. So the Aquin and the Bachwin, you can't get those again. Those are Plague Star ones, so you're limited. These don't give you MR rating, but the two pole arms I use are the Shaktun, which is uh, increases damage uh, and critical at the cost of speed. It's very slow, but uh, it's worth it. So if I add it, and then I add links, so each of these link combinations will give you different things. You can read what they say as you go through. So this one gives you speed and status chance at the cost of damage and crit chance. This one gives you increased damage and status chance at the cost of speed and crit chance. This one gives you increased speed uh, and status chance at the cost of damage and crit chance, so on and so forth. So, like, I normally use this one, which increases damage and critical chance at the cost of speed and status chance. So when you have it all crafted, 
you can see here this is what this build is so this is the build i have right now this is the one that i use for my uh this is ungilded so when it's gilded you'll see the stats change dramatically see my crit chance goes to 34 percent uh all of my other my leap attack my spin attacks <clears throat> they all jump up my slash damage goes way up puncture goes way up and <clears throat> impact is just in you're basically using it for slash it's basically what you do, which basically cuts right through armor so that's what you want but now if you come in here now you have your stats so you have a craft and you're like oh well what what if i change this out for this one okay now i've, I've changed it out uh it's still a staff i'm gonna get I'm going to reduce my slash. I'm going to gain puncture. I'm going to gain a little bit more impact. I'm going to get a little bit more spin to win damage. My crit chance is going to go up slightly. Base. And my crit multiplier is going to go up. <clears throat> so you're like, oh, okay. So let me change that out. So gilded, it does 32%. 2% multiplier and then so on and so forth so you can check each one of these weapons so like if I want to go with this one so what does this one look like they shall work wonderfully together. so 151 35 so you can preview the different stats so this one here if I change this what changes Everything drops except for status chance. Crit goes up significantly. Um, this one's a heavy. So if I change it to this one, my s crit goes down. But my spin to wind goes up. And my speed goes way down. It goes 665. The link, you just buy the link. So you come in here, you go to browse wares, <clears throat> you go over here where it says links, and then it's, uh, it's one of these, where the fuck is it? Right here, it's this one here. Increases damage and crit chance, the cost of speed and status chance. So... Well, once you craft, once you grab the blueprint, you can go back and fucking craft it on your ship. It tells you it tells you what you need to craft it too. So you need five thousand credits. You need map uh, maprico. You need some first steel alloy. You need some claws and some true lock eyeballs. So yeah, you got they only unlock as you increase standing. So I'm kin. So you have to get the kin. You might have to get the kin to unlock them. I don't know what it is to unlock those specific parts. I just don't know. So. But that's basically how it works. <clears throat> so. <laughs> Hopefully that helps. Why does his head keep disappearing? What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? Holy shit. So weird. See what today's special is. Today's special is a thing 
of such beauty that I had to slap head like for looking at it indecently. That one's actually not that bad. It's got relatively decent attack speed and it's got 32% status chance. This one's actually not that bad. This would be a good one for Saren. So if anybody's looking for one, you can have it for 142 plat. That one's actually not that bad. It's got fucking a shit ton of slash damage too. And it's over it's over one attack speed. Or heavy blade, that's exceptional. Good gadoots. Yep, good gadoots. So what are we looking for for relics? How do I get the stuff you make the bits that I don't have? You have to you have to uh, you you have to get you have to cash in your standing. You have to cash in standing. And uh To kin, you gotta get standing. So you come to this guy here. So, so you go to Kanzu, you t you go to Osteron, and then you s you spend your standing from doing bounties and stuff. Uh, when you're in here, says, I can't go any higher, but you'll have an option at the bottom that says offerings or standing, and then you hit triangle. You give him what you uh you g or square. You get and then you give him the things, and he'll upgrade you each time you get enough standing. So, in order to get to, so that's how we, you, you gotta come to, you gotta come to Kanzu. But careful, he takes an early lunch. All right, chop chop. We'll say some high up commander is here to inspect the troops. Sent by the queens, they say. So, send the queens a message. Their troops are not welcome near Cetus. Nobody got that joke? Holy fuck. A bunch of fucking tight asses. I need those fucking lith relics. I need a sh I have a ton of these fucking axie ones. S fours. But I need the lith and the meso ones. It's all personal playstyle, I guess. It's all about personal playstyle. Like I like to spin to win with some characters and some characters like Necros, I just like to fucking hack and slash. So I'll use the Galantine Prime with fucking with Necros and just run around just fucking crushing everything. People people like uh Hydroid and people like uh um uh Korra, I will use uh I'll use a whip. So I can spin the whip thing. There's the supply beacon. Grab it. I can call in the drop.
location and clear out any nearby hostiles. I don't think I have the right synapse.
Oh, nice shot, dude. before the enemy can destroy it. More Grenier inbound. Don't let them find the drone. Take out the drone. Stay vigilant. Run out of options. Find him at the waypoint and capture the enemy. I have questions I want him to answer. The officer is near me. Track them down. There's the officer. After them. Two! Two vaulted relics, baby. Two vaulted relics. That's what I'm talking about. Give me those vaulted relics.
highway to the danger zone. Fine. No, we're inside, right? We don't need any luck, okay? Now we're on the same page. Second turrets. What happens? Breath of Idolon. <sighs> Breath of Idolon's good for a fucking trade. Flat. Kanzu's favorite gun, Swazdula Killer. Fucking Lith relics. <clears throat> I need the M2s, man. Get anyone to take that on. Early lunch for Kanzu. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I gotta fix. Fix, uh. Fix the synapse. Synapse isn't right. Something wrong with my synapse. I think it should be doing a lot more damage than that. I think it's the wrong. Probably not the crit build. Oh, there's a crit. It's a crit with dual. Why is it not? Huh. I feel like it's doing a lot of damage. I'm hiring combat talent. Let's talk race. Ayo, you are right in the Unum's sight, Suba. One more off the. Can I actually start getting some fucking lith relics, please? Fuck sakes. Telling me an important Oregon relic is. I only have one altered relic. The quills would like this relic back, and I would like to. Yeah, you know what? I would like to actually get the fucking relic. That would be nice. Can I get the M2, please? Fuck's sake. Holy shit, it's already 4 a.m., dude. Ugh. I'm only gonna be able to run this like two or three more times. I don't know. Gotta go to work, gotta go to work. Guess I'm doing this by myself. Indicate the green hidden supply cache at this waypoint. Search the area. That's one of the caches. Come on. Why the fuck? That's it. 
I need one more to go. Why is the cat's loot radar not working? Located the relic. The Grenier hid it in an armored vault. A point. Go. Quick. The vault's armor is too strong for the weapons to penetrate. I will hack it open. First, I need a pass from the guards. Setup seems to be working fine now.
Precious. <laughs> I think I've run this mission probably like the, the tier two, the second level one, like several times, and I don't think I've gotten the action. I mean, the lith relic one time. The only time I got the lith relic was from fucking defense and avoid on lower level. But the only problem is with that one, like you can get any lith relic, which sucks.
hijack one of them. The drone is nearby. Find it and hack it. That's it. The drone is under our control now. Escort it to the I located the relic. Gunir hid it in an armored vault at my point. Go. Quick. The vault's armor is too strong for your weapons to penetrate. I will hack it open, but first I need a data mass from the guards. Granny's house. Ooh, charged chamber. Very nice. Thank you. 
He apparently doesn't like being shot in the face. Two runs, no relics. Right on time, Sura. I see you. Seems like Conzo, to be honest. That Conzo, Conzo, that cheap bastard. Don't fucking, don't fucking give me my goddamn relics, man. I want my vaulted relics, you piece of garbage. Uh, what's up, R. Crockett? R. Crockett, right? Or is it? Our croc crite. Welcome. Welcome. Enjoy your stay. Feel free to converse. The other people in chat are. Oop. Let me move this because I don't need this anymore. I already know what relics I'm looking for. Josh is in chat, and Isaiah is in chat, and. Somebody else is in chat. Fusion. There's the captain. Take out the guards. Gotcha. You've been detected. Hurry up and free the prisoner before that collar explodes. The guards are down. Fuse the collar now. You freed the prisoner. Now escort them to safety. I already, I already have all the primes, but I want the vaulted relics anyway. There's, there's a couple of things. There's a few things in life that I enjoy, like platinum. I like, I like platinum.
official details of the walls are closing. Take out the scan. Once liberated, I'll scan it for intel on the spot. Look at that landing! That's fucking a boss landing right there. See that? I landed right inside the tent. They had, they, they had no idea I was even there. Right inside the fucking tent, like a fucking boss. Rip. Like peekaboo, motherfuckers. I opened up one of those fucking, those little armored carrier things one time, and inside the fucking thing was a whole crab load of like infested. Like, what the fuck? Yo, that was awesome. A shoot grenier. Oh, they're stuck in the air. Like fish in a barrel, man. I think it should be over by now, man. <laughs> Can we get a good drop for once? These lower tiered fucking relics are just not dropping. I might end up having to go back to the void. I get better luck with fucking the low tier shit in the void. Sit down, B. <coughs> you got some place to be. Oh my god, I got one! I don't believe it! Only 500 runs later did I get one of the fucking low tier ones. Wow, that's fucking amazing. Holy fuck. Hey, get me. I'll just do a barrel roll. Right. I'm fucking I'm top gun, motherfucker. Get out of here. Get out of here.
Dance, motherfucker. Dance. Dance like you've never danced before, Oberon. Dance. Dance, go boy! Most esteemed Sura, welcome. Off world, I'm hiring combat talent. Ah, our most esteemed Sura, welcome. soon. See, I got two of the Axie Relics to drop, right? And then I got fucking... I got, I got... Let's see what the likelihood is that I can get some... I don't know how it's possible for me to get two Axie Relics from the same fucking mission, but I can't even get one Lith, and it and I only got one meso out of fucking like four runs. That's insane. That's that's a bad drop rate. You would think that you at least would at least get one like per run. It's just and they're not even like the top tier drop, which is the weird thing. They're listed in the uncommon table drop, which is normally where the shit drops. Oh, this dude's fucking dead already. Do 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 do. Can I get into the fight, please? I'm gonna miss the first fucking drop because the fucking door won't open. Come oh, on, man. During the chaos, I intercepted a transmission that confirms the premier are holding the all-star prisoner. I've identified a drone that was active near the Ostrom's last known location. Bring it to me so I can examine its logs. The drone is nearby. Find it and hack it. That's it. 
The drone is under our control now. Escort it to the extraction point before the enemy can destroy it. They're sending another wave to take out the drone. Stay vigilant. Drone is nearby. Find it. That's it. The drone is Get the fuck down, fat boy. Probably got short footed. Even though that's a fucking garbage mod. See, that's how you make an entrance. See what I did there? I fucking flew in. I was like, what's up? Molecular Prime, motherfuckers!
no drop. That's sure footed. Vigilante offense is a rare one to get, so that's not too bad. Shit ton of endo. Got it though. Alright, well that was fun. Got fucking three relics, two in one mission, which is fantastic. That's great. That normally happens. Uh and then I got one in the remaining fucking like six moves. Fantastic. Oh, that's a terrible drop rate. Uh, let's see. I might have better luck getting a good quality drop out of the. I don't want to test that theory. It's five o'clock. So many fucking stabilizers. Huh. It doesn't. Wow, two Voban parts. Three Voban parts. I'll grab those parts, even though I don't need Voban. But because there are parts, I'll, I'll grab them. I can get a full set of fucking Voban. Regular Voban. Just right off jump. Just right now. Someone just logging in right now. Could have gotten all three parts required to make Voban. It was a relatively good frame. Why wouldn't you? Granny's house. Hey Josh, you think we should raid somebody? We've got three viewers. Oh. Security measures have locked the crew of the place. Destroy them. The reactor is going into stasis. Now is your chance to complete this push. It's whatever you can to make sure it never works again. Ah. Destroy. A coolant cell has been placed in the fuel port. Pack the console to reset the reactor. Pack the system until the coolant has flooded the fuel system.
Your sabotage is complete. Get to extraction. Watch your step tunnel. There are severe cooler leaks throughout the ship. Let's see who's available. Who's on right now? Is there anybody on right now we can read? No, it's only still. Let's see, is Backyardis on? That rage. We'll do backyard a series. I think he's gonna be auto hosted anyway. But uh just grab these other two Voban parts. And we'll do uh backyardus. And join the sessions full. Ain't that some shit? Uh. I don't need to wait. Just go. I'm a man. I can handle it. Uh. But since we are going to wind this bad boy down. You guys don't need to see me finish this out. The last fucking eh. Oh, 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 hang on. It's only two missions, so it's only two, it's only two missions. This is a defense mission. You must deliver payloads and defend a number of locations while I break into the network. Be prepared for heavy resistance. I can't do this without you. Terminal spotted. Upload me and prepare to defend. This will take a moment. Don't mind if I do.
still working on it. Continue to defend. I will consider what I've learned from this skirmish. to a terminal. Find one and patch me in. Granny's house. Daddy's house. Area completed. Move on. Doors are locked. Time to play. Daddy's house. slow well I know now I just blew that up but before I didn't fucking hit anything that I was fucking going off well, as fast as a fucking snail shit holy crap what is going on there ooh nice Corpus big boy. Piece of garbage. Hello, all the new people that like just magically showed up but didn't say anything. I see you. Thank you for stopping by. Enjoy your stay. 
Even though it'll be this one time and one time only. It's like a sale. Check out the check out the little streamer. <laughs> like, oh, isn't he so cute? Where's your mommy? Uh, you guys are actually just in, you're in perfect time, actually. We're, I have one more mission to do. And to grab the other Voban piece, which I don't need, I'm just doing it because I want to have a full set of Voban parts. It's very rare that you'll ever see three missions in a row on the fucking alerts that all have the Voban parts. Normally it's one here, one there, one here, one there. But for whatever reason, all fucking three parts just magically just dropped. That's very strange. This is a capture mission, so I just need Loki. <laughs> and then after... Hey, so all this stuff for this... Uh, do I get it? Planes? Oh, you mean the crafting material? Yes. Yes. And then, so you guys are just in, you guys are just in luck. So after I complete this last mission, you're actually going to be entertained by a very large, well, not a large, I'd say moderately large, moderately sized Warframe partner. And you can ask him everything you want. We're going to go check him out. You're going to enjoy his Aussie, his Aussie attitude. His fire, his passion, and he's part of the Beard Crew. Beard Crew. Now uh, you gotta do some fishing, you gotta do some mining, you gotta grab some of the plants. You need some, uh, Maprico, which is the orange looking trees. Everybody should have a nice beard. Everybody should have a nice beard. But that's what we're going to do. So that's the plan. So right after this mission, I'm going to go, I don't know what that was. Something just popped up on the screen. <laughs> what the, what the hell was that? Anybody else see that? Or is that just me? Oh wow! This was the easiest mission ever! Look at that! The easiest mission ever! And we're done! Just like that, all three parts. This mission took less than fucking 10 seconds. This was the fastest mission ever. There we go. It's all over. So, thanks for those that came by. Check out the stream. I appreciate it. So we are going to, we're going to go over and, we're going to go over and raid. We are going to go do, we're going to go check out Backyardus. Everybody enjoy his stream. You will enjoy his stream because he's awesome and he's funny and... And he calls everybody lemons. I just love the fact that anybody that calls somebody a lemon is worth it. So, that's it, man. Thanks for coming out. I appreciate it. I love all you guys. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.